You know, God moves in mysterious ways. And in Moses' life, he had to move in such a way to give him this, 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 this uh, assurance that my presence is going to go with you. But you have to add these ingredients. He, he said, I don't want imitations. I want quality spices. And so these spices, these, these, these four spices, along with the olive oil, which is five uh, 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 specific uh, oils, they were used to make a holy oil. The first one, we've learned that it's called myrrh. And myrrh was used to anoint or to oint, uh, you know, the deceased. It, it, it was to, to add a, 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 a longness to it where it would keep the body intact. And, 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 and so they would, they would utilize that. Um, back in those days, they had no embalming or anything like that. And so they would use the, 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 the oil to keep that body preserved as long as it could so that family could come. And, and so Moses was taught here and there that, that this oil, the first ingredient was you're going to have to let go. You're going to have to sometimes die to things that try to attach itself to you. And you're going to have to let go of that so that you can walk in this holy anointing. And, and, and you know this, you know, it, it's very easy. That's why the Bible says the road to destruction is wide because it's so easy to walk into that road that's so comfortable. But the road to everlasting life is very narrow and few, the Bible says, find it. Few find it. I believe in you and I together are a part of that few. How can you say that, Pastor? Well, because you're seeking God. And when you seek God, God opens up doors that no man can open, and He'll show you exactly the way to go. Hallelujah.